Now, if the joke is being played on the people being filmed, we need to ask ourselves, does the stunt actually change people's attitudes? So if Baron Cohen's characters expose racism, expose moral corruption, does that have an impact on the attitude of his audience? So unless the humour of the awkward interviews actually changes people's attitudes, Baron Cohen's humour might actually reinforce the problems he's trying to expose. And by this, this I mean we get this situation. And you've probably been party to this kind of um, this kind of response when you're watching um, Baron Cohen's work or something you know something similar. So those people who don't get the joke, those audience members who don't get the joke, or those audience members whose attitudes aren't changed, suddenly become part of the problem as well. They become equivalent to the racists, the immoral people that Baron Cohen is exposing. And then those audience members, that kind of unnamed, ignorant mass of the population becomes a source of amusement for people who do get the joke. So what I'm suggesting here is that unless people's attitudes are actually changed by Baron Cohen's comedy, all his work allows us to do is simply sit back and stroke our chins and go, oh yes, yes, you know, the world is really full of ignorant, immoral, racist, stupid people. Um, so it really ju ju just does reinforce the gap between differing political viewpoints. In other words, the very thing that we want to try and avoid doing in this unit. Or if we're laughing at um, Sasha Baron Cohen himself, is his work just one long politically incorrect joke? Um, you know, the image here is quite deliberate. Um, it's kind of funny. It's also kind of sexist. Um, does the humour from Borat and This Is America simply come from seeing people say and do what liberal society deems to be inappropriate. I mean, you know, one of the reasons why you might find this image um, funny is because it's so outrageously out of character with what we deem to be appropriate representations of women in the 21st century. So that might provide pleasure, that might provide humour, we might be able to laugh ironically at a photo like this, but is that socially useful? Does that actually do anything? Is there any political intent behind it? Or is being able to laugh ironically at Baron Cohen's politically incorrect antics and his offensive jokes, does that just simply make him a left-wing version of Milo Yiannopoulos? Simply a left-wing version of the kind of provocateurs that we've criticised in previous weeks.